Hyderabad is slowly but steadily eating away at Bangalore's dominance over the aerospace and aero defense sectors. CNBC's uh, Deepthi and Surbhi Padhyay find out why. The cabin of the Sikorsky S-92 chopper, which ferries U.S. President Barack Obama, and critical components that power ISRO's Mangalyaan have one thing in common. They're both made in Hyderabad. Hyderabad is slowly giving Bengaluru a run for its money when it comes to aerospace design. And that's not really a surprise. While Bangalore became an aeronautics hub thanks to ATL, Hyderabad has always had a stronger missile base, housing facilities belonging to the DRDO, the Defence Research and Development Laboratory, and Research Centre, Imirat. But over the last few months, Hyderabad has become a major draw for global aerospace giants, given its thousand-plus small and medium enterprises that are engaged in making components for defence institutions and an influx of IT firms that cater to the aerospace segment. I don't know if we can overtake Bangalore. We are actually on the right track. We might be able to do it, you know, given the policies and given the interest that our ministers are also having, both the industries minister and the IT minister, are very much focused on getting all the big-ticket players in this field. Hyderabad began establishing itself as a hub for aerospace and defense manufacturing in 2008 when Tata Advanced Systems set up a facility in India's first aerospace SEZ at Adi Butler near Hyderabad. In the last four months since the unveiling of the Telangana industry policy, investments to the tune of over 4,000 crore rupees have come into the city. Investors say Hyderabad's advantages over Bengaluru go beyond better infrastructure and an emerging industrial base. An ecosystem is beginning to emerge now if, if and when it will emerge into a full-fledged uh, aviation ecosystem to compete with the likes of, let's say, Singapore, uh, you know, that, that we will have to see and it will be based on uh, how much support, investment support, the government is providing. The city is getting fresh impetus from the Telangana government's decision to set up a second aerospace park spread over a thousand acres. This will be situated at Elimindu on the outskirts of Hyderabad. The government is also giving the finishing touches to an aerospace policy to be announced in November. Hyderabad is also going to be a hub for the aerospace and also defence, because different organizations, defence organizations are also already here existing. Bangalore earlier it used to be because now the atmosphere is totally different in Bangalore. So if the state government has its way, Hyderabad may soon become India's new aerospace and defence manufacturing capital. With Deepthi Bhatani in Hyderabad, in New Delhi, Surabhi Upadhyay.